welcome 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 it's your girl priscilla kuma once again thanks for sharing subscribing hope you're safe today you have to come along on a tour with me to letchworth state park st Moritz, new york state this is a trip to letchworth state park which was barely an hour for me this is a large corn farm well called maize maize is a foreign word people are unfamiliar with that so i go with corn noun so this is the entrance of the Letchworth state park this is the map to find out where you want to go it is a very very huge park one time voted the best in america so come in and talk with me shake dance as you can see i'm doing and let's go through what Letchworth State Park. Make sure you watch to the end because there's an icing on top of the cake. It's just the surrounding. I stop to take a breather. And I'm walking towards one of the overlooks. There are so many overlooks there. The one behind me is Hatchback Overlook. Hatchback Overlook is very, very deep. If you are acrophobic, that means if you have phobia for height, you don't want to get close and look that deep down into this. I felt dizzy when I did. It's very huge. Stretches all the way down. So as I said, there are so many overlooks. This is Hardback's overlook. We're going to move to another overlook in a minute. Lightweight Park is very huge. There are so many activities. There's snowballing, snow tubing in the winter. There's hiking, kayaking, swimming, and many others. Pets are allowed, but I think two pets per person. So you can bring your cat, your dog, your tiger, whatever pets you have just take a walk with them this is gadel overlook this is not as deep as hardbacks overlook this you just see water collected from a distance very far away it wouldn't make you feel dizzy as the hardbacks overlook did let's walk to another beautiful place it's very calming very relaxing Watch for yourself. So this has water flowing down. There are so many water bodies here from different directions. This is my first stop over and it's a beautiful sight to see. Wait for it. Can you see very calming very relaxing very quiet it went very early so it was like feeling like a vip in a big park by yourself in this social distancing era it's very good to go to places very early where there will be no crowd listen to the fresh water sound hitting the rock you know your girl has to stop for a selfie before the walk so i stopped made some videos took a selfie then i did a little hiking hike with me this is where we're gonna go get your hiking shoes ready let's go Exercise is good for the body. I hope by now you've cleared the misconception that being skinny means you are fit. You can see a very lightweight person with a very high cholesterol level. So do get your exercise in whenever you can. 
it takes determination i know it's not easy either your girl was out of breath whilst climbing but i had to keep going at the same time navigating the cameras making sure i got the right view for you guys so enjoy your watch I can say I walked for about two hours on the whole trip. As I said, a huge park, so you have to drive in between, make a stop, walk around, move your car to the next stop. But walking would be like two hours and it felt refreshing. I came back home, had a very good sleep, woke up refreshed. This is a very good view to see the water flowing down. As we climb higher, you see it clearer. So I had to go to the top to get a very clear view for you in Ledgework State Park and Maurice, New York State. New York State has a lot of water bodies. So this is part of the Finger Lakes region, Genesee River and many others. There are so many places to relax. They are not too far away. Then people began coming. We all had to put our mask on and social distance but it was good to see people coming in. It was getting to like 9 a.m. Walk with me to the car as we drive to another stop. Your girl is getting hungry, so I need to find some food to eat. This is where you register for the kayaking and other activities. So people were coming in to register they had their life jackets on. This is a restaurant. I had to go in without a camera. But I'll definitely show you the food I had. Wait for it. This is the outside of the restaurant. I was playing with my bear, feeding them some milkshake, strawberry milkshake. I was just goofing around. <laughs> This is my table. I ordered chicken palm, chicken tenders, some fries, and smoothies. Those are people arriving for their kayaking class, getting their life jacket on, and getting their training before they set off. Let's go to the icing on top of the cake. As you can see ahead of you, that is the waterfall. You don't want to come to Letchworth Park without visiting the waterfall. That is a very long drive ahead. Nature is very beautiful. Nature calms me. I love to see the green. I love to see water. So if you notice most of the places I've been at all oh, waterfall, greens, it's very beautiful. And I saw a little snake here, very tiny snake. That was surprising because this is not originally noted for snakes. But I saw a very tiny one. I couldn't capture it on camera. It was too swift. Watch the mist. Look at the water gushing down. Look at the mist rising. So, so beautiful. So marvelous. Nature always marvels me. I had another hiking section here. I walked all the way to the bridge, but unfortunately couldn't capture that on camera. But this is a selfie for you. I wouldn't go without taking one at a very beautiful place as such. This is me saying bye-bye to Letchworth Park. Subscribe, share, thank you.